what's up, guys? It's me, your boy, Fear Razor, or J-Man. That's right, I'm going by, I'm going by some, trying some new names. <laughs> Anyways, guys, welcome back to another story, guys. As you know, I tell my stories. They're all real. At least, I tell you that. If you want to believe that or not, it's up to you. But I like to keep my stories legit and true, and that's why it's been a while since I've uploaded one. Because life has been not that exciting, I guess. However, I know you're looking at the title of this video and being like, is he, is he legit? Is he serious right now? No, no, no way this happened. He's full of it. He's full of it. But I can assure you guys, this is a pretty intense story and it's not a lie. So before I get into it, be sure to subscribe for more great content. Of course, I'm almost at a million subs, guys. We gotta hit that million. Okay, we gotta do it, and I need your help. So share this video, leave a like, tell your friends, follow me on Instagram and Twitter, and without further ado, let's just get right into this story, guys. So, guys, <sighs> the bomb scare. Now, as you know, this is not a joking manner, and I will just say this now as a disclaimer. This is, I'm telling the truth, and I'm saying it a lot in this video because, um, you know, bombs and terror attacks and all this stuff is no joking manner and I'm taking this very seriously because of how how scary it was and how intense it was and luckily I came out of it unharmed so what happened was I had to do my taxes now if you don't know if you're not an adult yet when you get to my age when you become an adult you have to start doing taxes and stuff and it sucks okay being an adult just is a headache but I had to do it anyways, and you know, my mom happened to come up because she was visiting. So my mom came up and helped me with my taxes because it was a lot of stuff to mess around with, and I had to go to H&R Block, and that's a, that's a company that helps you do your, file your taxes and stuff. So boring stuff, clearly. And um, so me and my mom, we go downtown Toronto, and we, we, go to the, uh, we go on this road, and we go into this H&R Block, we walk there, we go in, we do the taxes, blah, 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 all that fun stuff. And the guy there tells me, he's like, all right. He's like, you're going to have to come back in about a few days time to pick up something. So I'm like, yeah, okay, sure, whatever. So we finish up the taxes, the boring stuff. We go home and I'm just like, oh my God, I don't want to have to go back there again and pick up more boring stuff. But, you know, being an adult, you got to, right? You got to own up to that responsibility, right? So this is where things got really weird. So I woke up one morning, uh, my mom had gone back home and I had to go out and I had to pick up this forum from, <clears throat> from the H&R block. So I, I, uh, I took the subway and then I got off the subway and I just started to walk. I, I actually walked down towards the area rather than take an Uber because I just wasn't feeling it. I wanted to go out, it was a nice day and I was walking down. So as I'm walking down the street, I noticed there was police and um, there was do not cross uh, tape and they were blocking off the roads. And there was a bunch of people all around this street, like kind of like looking around, you know, the typical scene where you know something's happening. Um, and I was and I was running late to get to h and Block. I was literally running late. I had about 10 minutes to be there. So I, I ended up running. <laughs> So as I approached this section of the street and I saw the police and all this stuff and people kind of like wondering what was going on and stuff, I was looking at this and being like, you know what, I don't have time for this and I've got to go get this for them or else they're going to, I don't know, they're not going to be pleased with me. So I ended up just kind of walking through the street where everybody was like kind of, where this commotion was happening. I mean, nobody was like, like screaming or anything, but there was a commotion and People were getting wary. That's what I saw anyways. A lot of people just standing around, you know, the typical scene. So, and there was a lot of police. Like, there was a lot. And I'm just like, what is going on? And I kind of just thought maybe they were doing some sort of construction or, or maybe some sort of accident happened. Legit? I don't know. I wasn't, I wasn't really thinking about it. But anyways, I ran through the street and uh, the h &R block was literally a little bit down the road. And, uh... Afterwards, I ran inside and I grabbed my forum and I'm looking at the dude who did my taxes and I'm like, did you see that? Do you see, like, do you see the commotion going on down the road? 
And he was like, yeah. He's like, I don't, I don't know what, what's going on. He's like, uh, that literally just happened, like, not too long ago. Like, maybe, like, 15, 10, 15 minutes ago. Everybody started kind of, like, freaking out a bit and panicking. So I'm like, okay, that's really, that's strange. And anyways, I ended up, I had to walk back the same direction. So I, you know, I went back through the road again where everybody was. And they didn't have the sidewalk blocked off, might I add. They just had the street blocked off, so cars couldn't go. So, if that's what you were wondering, I wasn't just, like, walking past the Do Not Cross tape or anything. Uh, but I, I legit just, um, I just walked down the road. And anyways, you know, I walked past all the commotion and all the cops and stuff. And I was like, alright, whatever, I'm just, I'm just gonna go back home and, I don't know, do some videos or something. So, I go back home, right? I get back home, I sit in my chair like I'm doing right now, and I'm like, oh man, taxes are done. I'm so happy. I'm like, I'm like spinning my fidget spinner. I'm just like, yeah, yeah, that's right. Don't have to do any more adult stuff. Just kidding, I didn't have a fidget spinner then. And, <laughs> and um, then I look on the news, and I see that the commotion that was going on, the street that I just ran through, was uh, a street they had closed off where they confirmed that there was a bomb threat, and the the uh, they had they were in this process of getting a bomb squad and completely closing off that entire road, and I'm guessing since when I arrived in the area this had just happened they hadn't closed it all off completely, so yeah I ran through a road that was closed off because of a bomb scare. And luckily, I don't think there was uh, a bomb. I don't know. I didn't really look into it a whole lot. Um, but yeah, you know, it was it was pretty weird thinking about how I just ran through there without thinking about it, and then coming back home to to read on the news that there was a a bomb scare, and it was it was pretty legit, guys. Like the the whole road was like full of people, kind of getting weird and and worried. So, you know, the point of the matter is. Uh, really kind of made me realize how, you know, you really don't know what's going to happen <laughs> throughout your day. And I never once thought I'd run, I'd be in a situation like that. But luckily there was no bomb. There was no uh, anything. Um, nothing bad happened. And I came out of it unharmed and I got my taxes done. So that was, that was another thing too. But with that being said though, guys... The lesson I learned today is to always be wary of your surroundings and pay more attention to your environment. <laughs> and don't run into a road because you see other people there and there's a bit of a commotion. Don't do it, don't do it. Curiosity killed the cat, am I right? Um, but with that being said though, guys, that is my story for today. And I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, again, leave a like, subscribe to the channel. We are almost at a million subs. Which is awesome, and I can't wait to do it with you guys. Can't wait to hit that goal. And, uh, and yeah, check out TFR Games, my second channel. Trying to upload more on that for other games as well. But anyways, guys, I'm going to let you go. Be sure to check out all the other videos in this channel, and I will talk to you guys later. All right, guys? Have a great day, and a, I was about to say Happy New Year. <laughs> Enjoy 2017! <laughs> all right, guys, I'll see you later.